hi guys welcome to this video and in this video I want to talk about skill symmetric matrix of odd order and by odd I definitely mean like it's going to be something like 3 1 5 like that so what is the skill symmetric matrix well you might remember from the previous video that a symmetric matrix is a, a matrix which satisfies the property any general element a i j is equal to a j i but a skew symmetric matrix is a matrix which satisfies the property that a i j so this is a i j any general element is equal to minus a j i so the element of ith row and jth column is the negative of element of jth row and ith column so and the consequence of this property is that we can derive a general form of a skew symmetric matrix and remember all the elements in the principal diagonal are zero and all the elements below and above the principal diagonal are negatives of each other so this is minus b this is b this is c this is minus c this is minus a and this is a now i want to show you that if you take the determinant of this matrix you will get zero always so here i did this uh, when i expanded this I got ABC minus ABC which is actually equal to 0 so this was the case for a 3 cross 3 matrix but in general you can prove it for uh, any odd order matrix so uh, you can basically remember this important property if you have any skew symmetric matrix of odd order and obviously it has to be a square matrix because uh, this property relates to determinant and when we talk about determinant we are only dealing with square matrices right so when we have a skew symmetric uh, square matrix of odd order its determinant will always be equal to zero and there I proved this for a 3 cross 3 case uh, you can prove it for any case but it's not required because we are only dealing with 2 cross 2 and 3 cross 3 matrices so now I want to show you two quick and small applications of this theorem so here's my first question and you have to calculate the determinant of this uh, matrix first of all observe that this is indeed a skew symmetric matrix because all the elements in the principal diagonal are zero and you can see that it satisfies the property of a skew symmetric matrix right and it is a 3 cross 3 matrix obviously so its determinant is going to be zero because its order is 3 which is odd and it's a skew symmetric matrix now let's think about this matrix now obviously the principal elements in the diagonal are zero I mean the principal elements of the principal diagonal are zero but is it a skew symmetric matrix well it doesn't look like one when we uh, just see uh, from the higher level but let's think about this a minus b well we can factor out a negative one here and we can write it this term like this oops we can write this term b minus a like minus of a minus b and we can do this for all these terms what we will see what or what I'll see is that all th all these terms which are below the principal diagonal are actually negative of all the terms which are above the principal diagonal so it satisfies the skew symmetric uh, matrix property and therefore it is zero because it is also a three cross three matrix uh, which means it is a skew symmetric matrix of odd order so there I showed you uh, two examples and I also uh, talked about this uh, theorem which is a very important theorem and you can uh, memorize this for solving subsequent problems it's actually a pretty handy theorem as well so if you have any questions or if you have any problems uh, please leave a comment in the comment section below and thanks for watching this video